There's concern for parents in St. John's County this morning as floodwaters pose a threat for school buses to pick up students. Action News Jack's has team coverage on that nor'easter that thrashed our coastline over the weekend. Action News Jack's Beth Russo is live in St. John's County right now. And Beth, there's concern that some students won't be able to get to school because of water on the roads. And that's why the St. John's County School District released a statement last night saying that school will be in session today, but they will work with parents to help their students make up any work that they miss if they cannot get to school today because of this type of flooding. This is what we're seeing throughout Hastings this morning. And this is not just one or two inches of water we're dealing with. I'm going to walk a little bit deeper so you can get an idea of just how deep. I mean, the water could easily go over my boots if I were to walk any deeper into this road. Here's the other thing that I want to show you. If Kyle can pan down this street, these are homes that are flooded out. We actually spoke to a crew that was out here trying to get down the street so they could do work. The worker tells us that they actually were working to help homeowners who had their home is flood during Irma. They had gutted them out last week and that they were getting back into the homes today to try and fix them. He said he arrived here this morning to this just completely flooded out streets. You can actually see up and down these streets that we're seeing here in Hastings. Debris from Irma still on the curbs that's now being flooded and drifted away in this water from yesterday's nor'easter. Now I do want to bring you back to the St. John's County School District. They tell us that this morning and this afternoon they are going to be buses will be driving their normal routes when they see a scene like this they will turn around and so that is why they're working with parents we're going to be monitoring conditions out here and we'll have updates for you on actionnewsjacks.com for now we're live in hastings this morning beth russo fox 30 action news jacks the flooding